A very good morning, traders. So here we are on the Morning Glory strategy once again. All right. Okay, it's still Nakpan here, founder of Master of the Markets, Elite Traders Conference, and the Traders Open Day. So as you can see right now, we are on this cable trade, which I'm watching at the moment. Now, currently, in the morning, we did place a short order here, but we didn't get um, kicked in because uh, our order was two pips below and this big bar, this big green bar that you're seeing over here didn't get us in. Then we had a reversal move over here. Um, at that point, I was not next to my screen, so I haven't actually caught this move yet. So, what do you do when you miss a trade? You have to stay away from the market. You have to put a limit order in. So that's what I've got right now. I've got a limit order for the price now to come back to the level. If it doesn't come back to its level, I won't jump into this trade. Because you know why? Because then your reward to risk is skewed, your money management is skewed, and you do not want that. Because, do remember traders, that... Trading is based on probabilities. That's what we professionals do. We don't just do it just based on just hope and just trust. All right. So we have to get our price that we are looking for according to the statistical probabilities that we do have and according to our money management rules that we have as well. So currently right now, my order is for the low of this bar. If it comes, that's good. I'll cancel. I'll cancel that order once it takes out the low of the previous day, okay? Because the probability start changing once again as well. Because if I were to enter at the low of this bar, I would have probably got out at the low of yesterday because that's where my highest probability is because of the current bar projection that has happened. You must always consider the range of the bar that is occurring as of the current moment, okay, then there's a lot of mathematical problems you can start doing from that point onwards. And it's a lot to cover on that. That's why we usually coach only elite traders once they've made a commitment that they want to become professional uh, traders and take it all the way forward because it does require a lot of learning, uh, a lot of focus, and also a lot of uh, basically practice. And as we always say, when you actually do that, if you do that individually, of course, you'll take you more than 10 years even. And some traders that I know who has been doing it for 10 or more years can't even put still a single penny into their pocket. So this is why hanging around the professionals can shortcut your journey so much, okay? A good strategy can save you 10 years. And when you hang around the professionals, I mean, a strategy like this, when you know all the probabilities of it and the bar range formations around it as well, you can probably learn it just within like three to six months, okay? And the lifestyle that you get out of it is just absolutely amazing. All right, okay, so I'm just going to watch this straight. I'm going to see how it goes and I'm going to update you guys as time goes along. All right, traders, so on this uh, trade right now, as you can see, we did have a limit order over here for it to be filled. But currently right now, as you can see, for the next two hours, it's still not taken out yesterday's low. So what I'm going to do is now I'm going to delete the order because just on probabilities, because usually when a trade, especially on cable, what we have done our research on, when it comes to four or five pips away from its target, it should be taken out within the next two hours, especially when it comes during the European session, because it did come very near to that during the Tokyo but it didn't still take it out. And then the next now has come again, once again, very near to yesterday's previous day's low. And it still hasn't taken that out yet. As you can see, there's about four pips away, right? So because of that, I'm going to be taking out this position and we are not going to be uh, placing that anymore. Now, for those of you, or if I would say that if I were in this position still at the moment, then what I would then do, would do an early cover on this and I will move my stop to over here, okay, just behind those bars, right? Just because of the time that it's taking to take out the previous day's low. Now, in the event that it does take out the previous day's low, if it does take that, it continue to take that out, then where should you be looking to get out at your 0.7 ATR range, okay? 70%, 70 to 80% of the time, it will fill that range, okay? You can take a note of that. The level that you need to take a note of for today would be 129.35. 129.35. And you can see that now cable is gaining some momentum over here into taking out yesterday's previous day slow. Okay, so I'll let you all observe that and how it goes towards those 0.7 ATR range. And as we always say, till the next time, stay disciplined, follow your trading plan, and keep trading like a master.